Today, we are kicking off the third day of a unique first of its kind food drive here in the Metro. A lot of people are helping out, and with your help in Harvesters, we're collecting food for those in need. Jenna Hancher is live at the Price Chopper in Olathe with more. Jenna, it's so great to see so many people out there. It is good to see people out here, and things are starting to pick up here at the Price Chopper. We're here at 159th and Merlin in Olathe, and things are definitely starting to pick up. We're starting to see more people come and donate, and we appreciate all of the donations, but please, we prefer perishable goods and not frozen goods. This here, this truck, it's only a fridge, so it cannot hold frozen goods, but it can hold refrigerated goods. If you can see here, those donations have started to pick up. We have meats, we have cheeses, we have um, yogurt and great things for the kids for lunch. Usually you hear about non-perishable food drives like canned goods and things like that, but this is really the first of its kind. It's a perishable food drive with healthy foods. I spoke to people who donated this morning who say giving back is important. You know, there are certainly those that uh, are not as advantaged as us. So, you know, where we can do our part to help those that are less fortunate, you know, I think we should uh, certainly pitch in and, and do that where we can. I've been trying to get involved in this community for a while, and this is one way I could contribute to um, people who are less fortunate. We're joined now by Sarah Biles with Harvesters. Thanks for joining us. Where are we now in terms of um, collecting money and collecting goods? Well, we just got the totals in for the last two days, Monday and Tuesday, and we're at a total of 3,600 pounds of food, which equates to about 2,700 meals. And then through the virtual food drive, we've got another 28,000 meals, so we're more than 30,000 meals already in just two days. Wow, that's perfect. Thank yes. you so much, Sarah. And if you come while we're live, we're giving away um, bags if you choose to donate. Fill the fridge bags. They're insulated. So come down here. We're 159th and Merlin in Olathe. Reporting live in Olathe, Jenna Hanchard, 41 Action News. All right, Jenna, that is fantastic. More than 30,000 meals. That's great. If you can't make it out to Olathe today, we know that's far south. We're going to have two other locations this week. Tomorrow we'll be in Bonner Springs at the Price Chopper on Commercial Drive. Then on Friday we'll be up north in Kansas City at the location off North Ash. And if you can't make it to any of those, you can still help. You can always donate online at KSHB.com slash fill the fridge. 30,000 meals. That's amazing.